Hey guys, I'm Rosalvain, and welcome back to another part of Fallout 4. Uh, I would want to call this Game of the Year edition, if you guys want to call it that, because I do have the season pass, I got all the stuff. But yeah, it's been a long while since I've played Fallout 4. Um, yeah, it's just, it's so weird, because I haven't played in such a long time due to uh, my disappearance for school, and additionally, I just kind of, I guess, stopped. I just can't bear to think what might have happened to poor Imogene. Sure. Jack says there's no hurry about finding Imogene, but he doesn't mean it. Got it. Alright, so, yeah, like, a lot has happened for Fallout 4 in general. Uh, well, one of them is technically the updates for uh, Creation Club, I think. Yeah, apparently the Creation Club stuff has been slipping into the game's main menu stuff which is really weird i i genuinely don't i genuinely don't care about the creation club because there's a thing called nexon or nexus mod i mean like nexus mod is like literally the place where i would go for mods versus creation club i mean i commend bethesda for trying but just the idea of having another mod place is really not ideal i mean considering that all the same stuff you would see on there would probably be seen in nexus mod for like free versus it being paid but i don't know i mean i've talked about this way back when oh the machine's coming back after me <laughs> but like i'm t i've talked about this like way back in like the older parts of the series and such so i mean it's not new in any sense Ask around the third rail about... Okay. Yes. Alright, sorry. I'm, <laughs> I'm starting to get a little sick, I guess. Because it's getting cold, and then I'm like... I'm super duper, like, warmed up because of the weather. And then it's, like, cold again. And I'm like, ah. Uh. So I'm kind of getting a mixed sign of, like, temperatures and such for myself. Alright, let's go and ask around for clues about imaging. Um, but yeah, I don't know exactly where I left off at. I just, I think I just went for this in general because <clears throat> I went for this in general because I don't genuinely know what exactly I was planning on doing for the most parts. Like, I really just go with whatever I feel like doing. Hancock says newcomers are welcome in the third rail. Go on in. Okay. Hey. Enjoy your stay. Alrighty then, I guess. Alright. I wonder how this place looks like it down here. Oh, they actually like wall off the the subway. This is a whole like different setting about the the railroad. Another one of you mercs looking for McCready? He's in the back room. Good. Oh, uh, now that is some armor. Check out those hydraulics. Can't say I'm surprised. Sure. A dump like this, McCready. I was wondering how long it would take your bloodhounds to track me down, Winlock. It's been almost three months. Don't tell me you're it getting rusty. Should we take this outside? It ain't like that. I'm just here to deliver a message. In case you forgot, I left the gunners for good. Yeah, I heard. But you're still taking jobs in the Commonwealth. That isn't going to work for us. I don't take orders from you. Not anymore. Seems like a shootout. Like, <laughs> take your girlfriend and walk out of here while you still can. What? Winlock, tell me we don't have to listen to this shit. Listen up, McCready. The only reason we haven't filled your body full of bullets is that we don't want a war with Good Neighbor. See? Oh. We respect other people's boundaries. We know how to play the game. It's something you never learned. Glad to have disappointed you. <laughs> you can play the tough guy all you want. But if we hear you're still operating inside gunner territory, all bets are off. You got that? You finished? Yeah. We're finished. I feel like I've killed a lot of gunners before, but I don't know. Look, pal. If you're preaching about the Atom or looking for a friend, you've got the wrong guy. If you need a hired gun, then maybe we can talk. Uh... Maybe. Why don't you tell me who those guys were first? A couple of morons looking to climb the ladder of success by stepping on everyone else on the way up. <laughs> That's how it goes when you run with the gunners. 
All right. Uh, Stewart. Like you can handle yourself, but I worry about those guys throwing a wrench in the works. If you're worried about Winlock and Barnes, don't be. They couldn't kill a squirrel with a rocket launcher. And what about you? How do I know I won't end up with a bullet in my back? Are you always this suspicious? Hey, you approached me. And frankly, I'm taking a huge risk being out here in the Commonwealth in the first place. So I'm not about to leave anything in chance. Which brings me back to my original question. Can I trust you? Risk. <laughs> Make an offer. All I can give you is my word. And a bunch of caps. Bunch of caps, huh? Okay, hotshot. Price is 250 caps. Up front. There's no room for bargaining. Uh. Everything's negotiable. Would you take 200? Drive a hard bargain. No, <laughs> but wow. You bought yourself an extra gun. All right, boss. Let's get out of here. No, 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 no. Cancel this. Cancel this. No, doggy, don't go, don't go, don't go. Uh, let's go. Uh, McCready, you should go to the, uh, where, what, where's Sanctuary? Oh, the Sanctuary. Confirm. Alright, cool. Yeah, I didn't know why they sent McCready on me. Yeah, I didn't mean to get McCready on to... Stay free, man. Excuse me, miss. Hmm? What's the matter, handsome? Don't tell me you didn't like the song. No, it's not that. Wait. Isn't she the... I think it is. I think. I'm not sure entirely. I might be wrong. Whatever. Uh, one I just talk. wanted to talk to you. Hmm. Well, I thought that's what we were doing. Now, there's something special about you, isn't there? But don't tell me. Let me guess. Ah, of course. It's those powerful muscles of yours. My. I could get used to looking at those. So what brings a man like you to my part of town? Yes, yeah, yeah. She she might be the chick I was or lady woman lady woman that I, I, I would think it is. Uh that was mentioned a while back with uh the single player experience. If you haven't seen the commercial of the single player experience that Bethesda was trying to offer, uh Take your time. I'll just be Writing a song in my head. Yeah, I think she's the one who did the old school Wonder Woman like sh TV show, and she's just voicing this character, I think, which is really interesting because she does sound like her. I think it is the same character. <laughs> I might be wrong, but. Uh, what do you think? We're all trying to forget something, are we? I think you and I are gonna get along. So okay. it's my turn to answer questions, right? What can I do? For uh, wife Fleur. This one. You know Imogene Cabot? Imogene? Sure. I know her. I haven't seen her in a while, though. Were you a friend of hers? Uh, she's missing. She's missing, and her family's worried about her. <laughs> well, I'm glad somebody's looking out for her. She seemed like a body that could use looking after. What? <laughs> Please tell Please me. Tell me what you know. There was this preacher fellow who used to come in here all the time. One of the slick ones. Always going on about remaking your life and so on. Most of the customers wouldn't give him the time of day. But Emma Jane, she latched on to him for some reason. I don't mm. suppose it hurt that he was easy on the eyes. Mmm, intense. Some women find that irresistible. Pam, would you come over here a minute? What up? Don't tell me you're gonna make him kick me out. Is there a because... problem, Miss Magnolia? No, this fine gentleman here was just looking for Imogene. Do you happen to know where that preacher fella came from? Hmm, Brother Thomas. Yes, that's right. The one Imogene was always hanging on. Had to throw him out. Wouldn't stop bothering customers with that salvation racket. Kept oh. On, <laughs> on about joining him at the back bay. Oh. Then he'd shove those stupid flyers in your face. Oh, yeah, God. I kept one of them, just in case he didn't pay his bar tab. Mm. Well, thanks, honey. You were a big help. Anything for you, miss. I hope Evan Jean's all right. 
I didn't much like the idea of her going off with that preacher fellow. Thanks, Magnolia. Hey, AKA the lady yes. who What, you need something to take a AKA game? the lady who right plays Hotel Wonder Expert. Woman in the older days, the olden days. Toss out the troublemakers. Keep that in mind. Thank you. Oh, wrong direction. This way. All right, let's go and help Emma Jean and then I'm going to focus on the main mission stuff from here on out because I think that I'm starting to get more and more anxious about like completing other stuff now. Because I feel like this game has kind of drawn itself longer than it should be now. Like, I'm, I'm starting to realize I really don't enjoy doing more side quests further and further as I go. Because the pacing-wise, like, when I'm editing my videos, pacing-wise, I take too much time just trying to go through the whole, like, movement of it all. Like, I, I get too, sort of, like, enticed to the movement of where to go and such. Okay, so that's where the person's at. Let's go here. Yes. Yeah, so I'm kind of getting... Pa the pacing-wise, I've been doing this game... Or I've been playing this game in a slow, slow manner. And I mean, it's best to play this in, like, hour... Like, in, like per hour, like, episode-wise. But I haven't done that, or I didn't want to do that, because... I felt that the episode would make, like... A long time it would take a long time to just just to edit and uh, upload it in general so i just wanted to have it where it's like at least a good pacing wise but seeing how i'm just spending time doing a lot of side quests and like getting to know the world which i am fond about like i i'm, I'm fine with just knowing the world um i just generally feel like it's just getting slower and slower in pacing because i'm starting to get more stronger uh okay Oh, I was, yeah, I was running out on uh, Fusion Core, and they were like, okay. They're like, okay, we're gonna let you. I don't want to pull a gun on them, but I may have to, depending. All right, let's go. I'm guessing these guys are okay people, hopefully. Oh, the dog me just teleported there. Hello? Welcome, neighbor. We're always glad to see a new face around here. Tell me something. You ever feel like this whole world is broken? Do you ever wonder why things can't be the way they were in the good old days? I'm not gonna care. I'm looking for Imogene Cabot. Oh, I'm sorry, but Emma Jean is indisposed right now. She's not seeing visitors. Don't make me shoot you. Is she What's a member? Doing here? Is she a member of your movement? Actually, she and I are... You know... Romantically involved. Not that it's any of your business, but... She and I are just having a little... Relationship trouble. Hmm. You know how it is. No, I don't <laughs> know how it is. seeing anybody until she cools off. Uh, I'm a friend of the family. Maybe I can talk some sense into her. I said she wasn't seeing anybody, including you. You're not holding her prisoner, are you? No, she's not a prisoner. She's just locked in her room until she calms down. Oh yeah, you are treating her like a prisoner. Threatening to run off. You know how women can get. No! I'm going to see her, one way or another. Your choice. You picked the wrong guy to mess with, pal. You did too. Ow. Ow. Ah. Why are you hitting my dog? Wow, everybody is like so stupidly dumb. You're trying, trying to hit my dog. Okay, let me go and get out of my big guns. I really want to just shoot them all dead. <laughs> because that's not cool, dude. No, not that. Let me see what else do we have. Um, do we have ammo? Oh, we do have ammo for this. We'll try this, I guess. <laughs> Screw you. Oh, 
I got him in the leg. Got him. Wait, did he not see me? Uh, I'll get that, I'll get that, get that, get that. Don't worry, dog meat, you'll heal. Don't worry. And I got a lot of ammo for this gun in general. I don't know how I got this gun. I actually don't recall ever getting this gun and never using it. Why did I not use this gun then? What the heck? It, it is this good. Oh, they're still shooting. The guy, some, some guy is still shooting at me. I do not know. Okay, good. They're all dead. I don't know. I might have... Ah. There's a guy sitting behind the bush for some reason. Where the hell did the person go? What? I don't... Oh, there you are. There we go. Who else is here? I'm confused as all hell because I do not understand. Ah, god dang it. Oh, there you are. Sheesh. Where are you, where are you looking at? Hi. Ow. I mean... Oh, dog means back. Okay. So yeah, after the fight was over, it would have been easier. I mean, like, it's their fault, darn it. Like, I didn't care, to be honest. Like, ooh, there's a lot of gold watches. Alright. Uh, cram, nuke, mini nuke. Woo! Dirty water, sure. Ready? No. Sunglasses. I don't get what stealing would even afford here. Like, like why would this matter if I stole something from them? They're like, eh, they're dead. At the same time, they're the one who freaking picked up a fight against me. Like, I didn't even do anything. I just, like... I was just being normal, and I was like, you can't just, like, treat m my semi-family member like that, you know? What is this on the floor? Probably decal. Like, you can't- you can't just go ahead and treat, like, a family member that I'm supposed to- that I'm supposed to, like, look after, you know? Like, you can't treat her like that. You gotta, like, freaking let her decide on it on her own. Let her decide on her own, like, if she wanted to. Cigar box, I'll take. Folder, no, I don't care. Oh, technical dog. Nice. I honestly don't know if I should use this gun furthermore, because I feel like this gun is great, but... Yeah, I guess. Hello. Uh, Emogene? You must be Emogene. Don't tell me. Jack sent you. Yeah, what happened to her age? You're Jack's sister. I was expecting someone a bit... younger. How rude. Don't you know to never mention a lady's age? Just to be clear, I'm Jack's younger sister, the baby of the family. Once I get home and get some of Jack's serum, I'll be back to my usual stunning self. Oh, I see. Interesting. No I fabulous. was just You look... <laughs> Uh, Even though I know you're just being polite. You're different than the thugs Jack usually sends. I just need some serum, and then you'll see why I was voted Miss Boston three years running. Okay. Uh... I don't know if there's only one bottle left, so... What happens if you don't get more serum? Oh, I don't think we need to worry about that. I've gone without a treatment much longer before with no lasting effect. Okay. 
Actually, there's only one vial of the serum left. Raiders got the rest. I'd better get home before Mother convinces Jack that she needs all of it. That he could still be such a mama's boy at his age is ridiculous. I'm so disappointed in Thomas. He seemed so interesting at first. But after we came here, he turned out to be just another brute. He actually thought he could force me to join his absurd cult. Oh, so it was just a toy. Okay. Your boyfriend's boyfriend's dead. dead. Let's go. Thomas? He wasn't my boyfriend. We had some fun together, that's all. Besides, he shouldn't have locked me in here. Don't yeah. worry, I'll find my own way home. Got I'm not it. quite ready to face Mother. And thank you. I really do appreciate you coming to find me. Even though I didn't actually need rescuing. I mean, I don't know that. Like, the mom wanted you to go back, so I was just like, whatever. I was, I just did what I was told. Like, literally, I just don't know. So far, this family is pretty fun to, like, yes. So far, this family matter is, like, or this family kind of thing is pretty fun so far, I mean. Like, I didn't think about it because I haven't played this game in such a long-ass time that there was this, like, storyline, this pinnacle storyline, or not pinnacle, like, an interesting storyline about this family that has like this everlasting serum thing or youth serum whatever it is but nonetheless i mean sure i guess it's it's just whatever so yeah i'm gonna try to finish up this storyline i think and then i will go into the main story stuff i think that's probably what i'm gonna be doing so far okay sorry i, I was looking at the uh my recording my recording button because right now it's like blinking. It's like constantly blinking now. It's not. It used to not blink a lot. Now it's blinking a lot to the point where I don't know exactly what's going on. Talk to Jack. Damn, the signal is strangely weak. Jack. Edward, switch over to the Hartley modulator. Do you copy? Not now. Watching now. How's this? Yes, that's good. Oh, 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 that's done it. Edward, what's going on there? We're under attack. They're inside the building. Inside? Can you keep them out of the basement? I'm trying, Jack. I I've never seen raiders that... Oh, God. For God's sake, Sammy. The doorway, right there. Uh. Sorry. Things are a little busy around here right now. Listen. If they're inside the building, you have to go to the office and shut down the elevator. You can't risk them getting to Lorenzo. Got it. Office. Elevator. You better round up whoever you can and get them. Hello? Edward? Come in. Edward! Ah. There's no signal at all. I've lost him. What's happening, Jack? If these people are inside Parsons, if they free him... Don't worry, I'll handle it. I always knew it would end this way. I never should have allowed you to lock up Lorenzo in that place. That isn't helping, Mother. And as I recall, using the serum was your idea, not mine. So what oh. are you going to do? I said I'll handle it. I'm thinking. I don't need anything right now, thank you. What's going on? <laughs> that was Edward. He's at Parsons, the old asylum. They're under attack by raiders. It's strange. The guards have held off raiders before without any trouble. I don't know what's gone wrong this time. Uh, is it the same Probably raiders? The same raiders that stole the serum. Hmm. Could be. If some of them had used the undiluted serum, it could explain their unusual success against Edward's men. Yep. Uh, I found, I found Imogene. Imogene. She's fine. Oh, yes, good. Thank God. At least one small comfort on this terrible day. You'll be wanting yeah. to be paid, of course. Edward usually handles these things. Caps is what you use for currency, isn't that right? Here, I hope that's the right amount. Before we go, I need you to understand something. When we get to Parsons, you need to do exactly what I tell you. Nothing more, nothing less. Is that clear? Sure, I can try. Okay. Good. Make sure you have whatever you'll need for a serious battle. I'll wait for you outside. Jack, be careful. And... Try not to hurt him. I love father at least as much as you do. But 
You know as well as I do that if he gets free, there will only be one option. Don't let it come to that, please. I'll do my best, Mother. And if Imogene finally comes home, for God's sake, don't let her leave again until I get back. Now I really do have to go. Alrighty. Well, that's an interesting story piece to deal with. Alright, I do need to be careful here because he said that you need to prepare a really good... A really good, like, weapon to go fight against them because it seems like they're going to be a lot more difficult than usual. Uh, okay, ammo-wise, we're fine here, I guess. Alright, yeah, I'm gonna use my sniper rifle. I'm gonna snipe them all out, nonetheless, if I have to. I don't even know exactly what his rules are. Like, he's gonna probably tell me, like, don't explode anything, because literally it will blow up the whole place. Instead, stealthily take them out or something. I feel like that's the case. I feel like that's he's, that's what he's gonna do to us. He's gonna be like, take care of them silently. And I'm like, trying. <laughs> but at the same time, I also want to mention, uh, yeah, going back to the Creation Club stuff and updates for Fallout 4. Yeah, Fallout 4 already had a Game of the Year edition just like sort of released in a sense. And additionally, they have released out all the updates I think they could. The only one big minus in the updates is the 50 gigabytes of retexturizing the whole game, I think it was. And I'm not entirely sure what it is, but I think it's the retexturizing of the game. And it was like 50 gigs. And I was like, what is downloading for Fallout 4? Is it the whole entire game re-downloading itself or something to just sort of like repair itself or something but it was actually just the freaking like dlc or the free the free content thing that update that just Ready? changes the Let's graphical go. power you know what we're going to be dealing with my father is confined to Parsons. for his own safety and everyone else's he became dangerously unstable after handling an ancient artifact he found in arabia i've spent my life trying to figure out how to cure him Okay, but yeah, that, that update was like ridiculously large, which makes no sense, like considering that if you go to Nexus mod and get a a smoother graphical thing that just sort of like smooths out the graphics or makes the graphics look prettier on the city, it's way less than 50 gigs. Like literally, it doesn't take that much graphical intensity just to get it working like that. Um, I mean, it's just be beautifying the texture the versus... That's made Lorenzo so dangerous. I'm sure his psychosis would be cured if it could be removed. But so far, sure. all my attempts have failed. It's fused too tightly with his nervous system. But yeah, at the same time, I just feel like it's more so just the... Uh... Yeah, it's just more so just the texture that just needs changing. And additionally, there is another thing that's problematic as well, which is the fact that... This game is lagging or stuttering or slow or anything of the sorts that's similar because of a DLC. Somebody mentioned it in the reviews for Steam for this game. Now that my family and I have lived for a very long time, thanks to the serum derived from my father's blood. Uh... I the alterations to his blood in some of my earliest attempts to remove the artifact. I eventually isolated the anomalous compounds, which led to the serum treatment we still use. I'm well aware of the apparent conflict of interest in my father being the source of the treatment that is prolonging my own life but i assure you that if i had the chance i would gladly give it all up to have my father back even for a short time interesting so this is kind of like a convincing i'm thinking jack's conversation with me is kind of like a convincing part to help him under help us understand like how important this fight or how important this like shootout may be with us trying to protect the father in the prison prison area but yeah uh back to the dlc thing yeah i don't know which dlc exactly i don't know what dlc exactly is the problem or the root cause of like this game sort of like being laggy or less performing than it should be but yeah i never had a lot of lag or issues before until like all the game like i i don't know how it came about where i started lagging and everything with this game in general but i don't know hopefully it was resolved if not then 
I'm gonna continually saying that that might be true. I'm not sure entirely because I, I saw in a review, but, I, but the person who reviewed it didn't say what DLC it is and like if it was resolved or not, like updated wise. Like some certain some per certain parts of these areas are like laggy as hell still. So whatever, I guess. Man, do we have to actually walk the whole way with this guy? Seriously, it's ridiculous. I may need to buy more fusion core, even though I have 24 of them. I feel like I have more somewhere. Do I have more somewhere else? I don't recall. Jesus. Yeah, I'm already at 30 minute mark and this guy's still walking. Can we, can we not, can we not fight? I gotta reload here. Come on. There we go. Better. Uh, wait, did I get the meat? There we go. Yeah, I just wanted the meat. Yeah, I just, I didn't want to waste ammo. I kind of felt like that was wasting ammo if I was to try. What? Mr. Gutsy, what the hell, dude? Why are you guys, like, starting to throw these weird stuff at me, really? All right, here we go. Got that guy hit. All right, well, the guy is down, I think. Oh boy. I'm a bit laggy, I don't know. See, yeah, th that's what I'm talking about. Like, the performance-wise, I don't get it. No, yeah, that's that's fine. We got him. We got him. Getting the fusion cell. Great. Uh, steal, whatever. Actually, let me heal up first before I continue. But yeah, I don't know why some places it lags. I mean, I'm not really, like... I'm not in particular, like, doing anything, like, crazy. Like, I'm not setting everything at ultra. Like, things are just sort of, like, normal. Like, things are just running about normally, like like a typical, like, Fallout 4 should have been. But it's just weird, because there shouldn't be any running issues if, you know, you run a, a 1080 or 1070. There we go. Let's keep going. Don't know why, don't know why. Is that a Deathclaw? Or is that a Merchant? Oh, that's a merchant. Okay. I was scared for a second. That was... I thought that was like a freaking death claw. I was like, oh no. We're gonna have to fight a death claw. Even though we fought one before. Like, we fought many death claws. Actually. Oh, we're getting closer. Yeah. But at the same time, we could have fast traveled, can't we? Oh, yeah, we can. We could have just freaking fast traveled there. Why the hell did I follow him then? What the heck? Yes, please. It said meet Jack at the place, not follow Jack to the place. They didn't tell me explicitly that was the case. I just walked out thinking that. <coughs> just think. I just walked out thinking that you didn't. You need to follow him in general. We're not too late. Edward's men seem to have given a good account of themselves, but not good enough, sadly. Oh, jeez. We need to get to my office. From there, we can see how bad things really are. Okay, stick close, follow my orders, and I'm sure everything will be fine. Let's go. Give me a second. All right, let's go. I don't even I I don't even recall ever walking in here. So, whatever it is is whatever. Um, I'm gonna stop it when it loads up properly, but thank you guys for watching. Leave a like, comment, subscribe if you guys haven't. Hope to see you guys in the next part or nobody minds, and hope you guys have a great, amazing day, week, and night, or whenever you're watching this. So yeah, in the next part, we will continue onwards with this one. I'm just gonna stop here in general because I don't want to waste too much time. I already wasted time walking with Jack and hearing his story and then talking about other stuff related to this game. But yeah, in the next part, we'll finish up this mission with Jack. I don't know if this is the end of his tale or his story uh, line storyline things but if it is then great i get to like move on to the main mission i'm gonna try to finish this game main mission wise 
and then I will probably move on to the DLCs, and then uh, I'll finish the series completely with just the main story stuff from all the DLCs and all the main story stuff in the original game by the uh, by the end of the series. Because I think that the side quests... Generally, I do enjoy the side quests. I do enjoy exploring everything. But the problem is it takes too much more time than it needs to be. And another additional thing is that I'm kind of getting bored. Because it's not that I'm getting bored of the game itself. It's just... I'm getting bored that I'm repeatedly uh, repeatedly just walking about and just like exploring in general like it's just repeating it is just repeatedly walking about the island or the lands of this uh, of Boston or Massachusetts in general just walking repeatedly around and just like not finding anything else besides missions and side quests that just kind of becomes a walk there to walk there to walk there to walk that and then kill that thing and then walk back or travel back and it's become sort of like uh not new anymore by that point like if it's like if, if there was a lot more rewarding stuff minus the money and the uh exp i think it would have been easier but there's such there's been such a, a a dryness of story after a little bit of time like after i've covered a bunch of like the storyline to this to the to the areas that i've been through i kind of get kind of like bored but i mean i would like to explore them genuinely like alone or in another time by myself um so that I could just sort of kind of get the gist of it. I mean, there are some stuff I'm missing that I, I've heard of, and I know that this game offers for story stuff, but I think that there comes a point where you find out all of them, and then you're just, like, you're done. You're, like, literally done with the game. But I don't know. I, I would love to keep playing, but, of course, time it takes to get everything done or getting everything all completed in, like, one tied-up knot is harder on... The channel versus me playing it on my own where i can just do it at my own pace like really quickly or really slowly depending on how it goes but other than that uh thank you guys for watching um there will be more to say there's more to probably do in this game as i keep playing in this game but other than that that's it for me in this part so Roz, out.